Hey guys, welcome back to World of Tanks with Nikina. Today we are watching Pinner the Pot play in the LTTB. And he is starting out on the south end of Mountain Pass. He's in a tier 8 game. Got pretty good matchmaking here. It looks pretty pretty even on both sides. Could be anybody's game. Now let's just sit back and see what he can do here. Now he's gone up ahead. He's pushing way up. Circling around. A little ballsier than I would be, but I think he knows what he's doing. Try and get some lights on the other side, but nothing yet. Which is kind of surprising. Usually there's at least somebody on the other side. Around the E3 area. But not today. You notice he keeps checking behind him to see what's going on. Make sure he doesn't get flanked. Alright. See if we can't get a shot into that Leo. Here we go. There's one shot into him. Eh, Leopard finally figures out there's somebody in front of him shooting at him. Leo bounces off him and he finishes him off. Now we got a bulldog up on the hill. Got auto lock on him. Let's tear him up. Second shot into him. Got a bulldog's getting tore up now. Rissa Pinner's team's tearing into that bulldog, and he's going to try to get his shots in that KV-85 now. First shot misses. Second shot lands short. There we go. He's gone. Meanwhile, the IS-2 has no idea that he's there. Oh, just can't quite get it. Just seems like every, most of the shots right there, just, they just kept falling short. Alright, time to move on. Let's see what other kind of trouble he can get into. Now, around the corner, we got the AMX 5100. And there's a nice, tasty AT-8 on low health. Get rid of him. Oh, now there's a Crusader SP. Beautiful side shot into him. Get rid of him. Now it's tearing to that AMX 5100. One shot in. There we go. Three shots. Yeah, that he was completely tunnel vision. Never even realized Pinner's on his ass. Gets, picks up the kill. He's up to five kills already. AMX pretty much just handed that one to him. Never once turned around to look back at him. Maybe a little bit of panic started to set in with him. Steward a mill. Let's see what we can do here. Get an auto lock on him. Get one shot into him. Hurry up. Get around the side of him. Oh, too fast. And one more to clean him up. There we go. And with that, with that kill, he picks up Top Gun. Now his guys are starting to drop like flies. They're still ahead, but 
it's really not worth it to try to go all the way back and try to kill those guys. Might as well try to secure the win and stay on cap. And that's just what he's going to do. Let's try to wait it out. He knows they're coming too. Just got to be ready and waiting. Any day now. No one coming up the ice road. And there the Hellcats trying to give him instructions and telling him how to play his time. Oh, he was going to go for the Panther, but he's seen the J Panther 2 is even lower health. Might as well get rid of that extra gun. Come on, get rid of him. Ooh, come on. There we go. Got rid of the J Panther 2. Now we can we control this Panther. Watch this. This is beautiful. <laughs> Yeah, he just circles and just completely clowns this guy. Look at this. <laughs> this is almost too painful to watch. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. So, with that, he picked up his 8th kill and just got a shy over 3,000 damage. That's not too bad for a little light tank. That's pretty much the end of it. Let's sit here on cap. I'm going to speed this up a little bit. No idea where that last tank's at. Alright. Ten seconds left and the cap's over with. And there it is. Whoa. There comes a rogue shot. And that is how you play the LTTP. Well done to Pinner. Ended up with 8 kills and just shy over 3,000 damage in a tier 8 game. Pulled way more than his own weight in that one. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that and I will catch you on the next one.